Let's learn how to make sticky toffee date pudding. First, we need to soak the dates. So I've got 100 ml of water here and I'm gonna bring it up to the boil on the stove. And I'm gonna chuck an Earl Grey tea bag in just for some flavor. Just take off the label. And while the water's on boiling, we're gonna add half a teaspoon of bicarbonate of soda to our dates. Now that the water's come to the boil, add the dates and the bicarb, sit a lid on top and let it steep for five minutes. Turn on your oven to 180 degrees and then we'll make the batter. 195 grams of self-raising flour, half a teaspoon of bicarbonate of soda, half a teaspoon of baking powder, 65 grams of nice soft butter, 115 grams of soft brown sugar, or if you have some nice dark sugar, but I didn't have enough so I just mixed it. One and a half eggs, which I've beaten, that's a great way to get your half an egg. Beat it up and then separate it in half. Two tablespoons of oh so messy treacle, and then with a set of beaters, it's the easiest way to do it, blend it all together. And once the butter's all beaten and looks like this, we can slowly add in the 185 mils of milk. Now we have the batter, let's just deal with the dates. Take your tea bag out and drain off the water, but do leave a little bit so that we can mush these dates up. And once it's all blended up, just add it to the batter. And then just grease your dish, pour in your batter, and into the oven it goes for 35 to 45 minutes. When your pudding has only got five minutes left in the oven, we're gonna make the sauce. I've got 65 grams of butter, 85 grams of soft brown sugar, half a tablespoon of treacle, remember, give it a twist, and 200 mils of cream. And that's gonna go on the stove to melt and we'll let it bubble for a few minutes. The cake has come out, the sauce has had a few minutes boiling, pour a little bit on top while it's nice and hot. Oh. This looks great. And the rest into a jug. Spread the sauce down the sides of the cake. And once it's all on the plate, you can just get stuck in. Oh, that reminds me of being a kid back home. Oh, I should give it a go.